simple. I see people all the time who want to have wellness communities like this community. And the only difference between me and them or me and you is just me putting in the time each and every day to facilitate these experiences, make sure that they're enjoyable for you, and to open up the dialogue to conversation. That's it. That is it. But most people will not put in the time for what they want. And when you have setbacks, babies, I had a good year or two where it was just me and might have been a thousand people. I know that I don't even think I got to a thousand people the first year. And you see how much I post these videos. But those people who were there, they were the right people. They were like we are now in this community. They were loving each other and supporting each other. And it was more purposeful than if it was just a lot of people there saying crazy stuff. I used to think, oh gosh, if I get on the internet, people are going to say crazy stuff. But what I realize is sometimes it takes a while for you to blossom and bloom because time is attracting the right surrounding for you. A lot of times when people are just kind of catapulted into something they're not prepared to, they may love it. They might fall under the pressure. And also, the people who are around them, they haven't had enough time to know who they truly are. You know who I am. You can go and look through all 620 videos <laughs> to see it. And it creates a safe space. You know when you come into this space, it is a space that is safe. I don't be allowing no riffraff. And, you know, that's just how it is. Baby. 
yourself in a greater and a bigger and more purposeful way. I think about it all the time as I facilitate different communities to come together and have these healing and self-care talks. I realize that the impact of me showing up and deciding to make sure that I post and making sure that I create a space where people can come and interact with each other, that that's impactful. So it doesn't really matter about anything else that happens as long as I'm able to create that impact. I feel motivated and excited to show up and to have these videos and to have these moments and to try new things out. It's the impact. It's not the views. It's not the subscribers. It's not people telling me, oh, Jack, you're so great. You can give me some more of that, though. I'm just kidding. But it's not that at all. It's the impact. When I read in the comments, someone saying, I went through this and I grew. And someone else saying, oh, that is so beautiful. I understand that, that my efforts create an environment where two complete strangers could come and make each other feel supported. So what are you doing? What is your impact? How do you connect with people? What is it that you're doing that you know? This is your karmic experience. This is the this is North Node stuff. This is what your soul promised yourself as it incarnated into this experience for you to do. What is that? If you don't know, that's perfectly fine. This is actually my favorite part if you don't know, because then you get to try out a lot of stuff. And who gives, and I'm serious here, who gives a motherfuck if it makes sense? It doesn't have to make sense. If you don't have to explain yourself to anyone of why you want to try this or try that. Baby, just try it out and eventually you're going to get to some things that stick. Some things that you like. And then when you get to that place of, okay, you figured out some things that you like, that you start seeing setbacks and instead of just reacting to them you start looking at them what, what is this trying to teach me where should I go from that and then you just keep moving on from there and just taking more and more steps each and every day sweetness so I'm gonna just take this all around you because I feel like the aura has been washed thoroughly
So love yourself more each and every day, okay? Well, take care of yourself, babies. I'll see you next time, okay? Bye.